You know what I'm starting to think, Harold? This was all had gold in it. Smell gold. Smell gold, yeah. It smells like shit. <laughs> My experience, like, really smell spot really, really hot. Oh, ho, 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 ho. She's rank. Gold tends to be, you know, from an older time. That's its stink, eh? Miners have always searched for clues in the ground to lead them to gold. A rotten smell is a sign that miners have dug down to an ancient layer of decaying plants or animals. This decomposed material can be a gold catcher, but it's not the only clue waiting to be found. During the Klondike Gold Rush, miners dug up hundreds of fossilized tusks, dating back over 10,000 years ago when woolly mammoths roamed the Yukon. Throughout millennia, river flow brought their remains and rich mineral deposits to rest in the Klondike. Where tusks show up, so does gold. That's a nice one. Where'd you pull that out of? Right there. This found a mammoth tusk. There's no tree shaped like that, so you know automatically what it is. Pretty cool. Some people seem to think that when you find mammoth tusks, it's an indication of decent ground. Say all these mammoths died elsewhere, and how'd they all end up in the one spot? I mean, it had to be a good flow of water, which would also bring the gold with it. Everything's better with a little bit of gold. 